Hello, and welcome to another edition of Let's Read Wiki. Today we'll be reading Rosen Maiden. Rosen Maiden is a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by Peach Pitt. It was serialized in monthly comic burrs between the September 2002 and July 2007 issues. The individual chapters were collected and released into 18 Tonkaban volumes by Gentosha. The eight volumes were localized to North America by Tokyo Pop between March 2003 and June 2007. Rosen Maiden follows Jun Sakurada, a middle school student who has withdrawn from society after suffering persecutions from his classmates. Following his withdrawal, he has chosen to become the master to a Rosen Maiden named Shinku. Shinku Maidens are seven sentient bisque dolls who compete against each other to become a perfect doll dubbed as Alice. Rosen Maiden received a sequel under the series Katakana title. It was serialized in Shueisha's Weekly Young Jump between April 2008 and January 2014. Rosen Maiden has spun off anthology manga and novel stories, art books, and four anime series. The four anime series are titled Rosen Maiden, Rosen Maiden Traumend, Rosen Maiden Overture, Rosen Maiden Zorukspulen, Tokyo Broadcasting System were the producers for the anime, with Nomad as the animation studio for the first three series and Studio Dean for Zurukspulen. The anime adaptations resulted in several audio disc releases and three video games. In 2007, Genion Entertainment USA licensed the first two anime series for North American release and had later signed Funimation on as distributor after shutting down in September 2007. In 2011, Sente Filmworks acquired both seasons as well as the third series. They made the three series available for streaming on Anime Network. Crunchyroll later acquired streaming rights to the first two series. For the fourth series, Sente Filmworks had acquired the license for digital and home video release while Crunchyroll acquired streaming rights. Tokyo Pop's volumes of Rosen Maiden have appeared on ICV2's monthly top 100 selling graphic novels. Reviews towards the manga were generally positive with reviewers praising balance in drama and comedy. For the anime, reception towards the series was mixed with Trowman was mostly negative. Plot in the 20th century, a legendary doll maker named Rosen created seven bisque dolls, which were powered and given sentience with a gem called Rosa Mystica. Since then, Rosen sent the dolls away to find masters and to battle among themselves to gather each other's Rosa Mysticas. This competition is referred to as the Alice Game. When a doll obtains all seven, they are to become a perfect doll dubbed as Alice and will be reunited with Rosen. By order of creation, the seven Rosen Maidens are named Sugintao, Kananaria, Suzezeke, Saozezeke, Shinku, Hinachigo, and Kirakisho. Rosen Maiden follows Jun Sakurada, a middle school student who has withdrawn from society after suffering persecutions from his classmates. He has chosen to become Shin Ku's master and joins the Alice game. As the series progresses, Jun also becomes the master of Hinachigo and Suzezeke. After Suzezeke's Rosa Mystica is taken by Su Jintao, Jun's Rosen Maidens resolve to revive her and to end the Alice game peacefully. They later befriend Kanaria, who shares their sentiments. However, the group is attacked by Kirakisho, who absorbs Kinachigo and traps Shinku and Susezeki in the end field, a plane of consciousness which connects the universe. Rosen Maiden concludes with Jun preparing to enter the end field to save the dolls. Rosen Maiden's plot is continued in the sequel serialization, which uses the katakana title of the series. Inside the end field, June is forced into hiding by Kirakisho and contacts an adult version of himself from an alternate world. 
the adult Jun is able to free Shinku and unite the Rosen Maidens to defeat Kirakisho. Kirokisho returns and successfully captures all the Rosen Maidens' masters. The Rosen Maidens pursue her eventually resulting in most of their defeat except Shinku and Kirakisho. Shinku's sympathy towards Kirikisho's loneliness convinces the latter to surrender her Rosa Mystica. With all seven gathered, Shinku becomes Alice. Using her new powers, Shinku revives her sisters and is put into a coma in return. Release Rosen Maiden is authored by Peach Pit and was serialized in Gentosha's monthly comic Burt's between issues September 2002 and July 2007. Gintosha compiled the individual chapters into eight Tonkaban volumes released between March 2003 and June 2007. These volumes were later recompiled into seven Shinsoban volumes by Shueisha and released between April 2008 and November 2008. Tokyopop localized Gintosha's Takoban volumes in English for North American and released them between May 2006 and May 2008. In 2011, Tokyo Pop's North American division was closed down and their licenses to manga franchises were revoked. Tokyo Pop's translations were distributed in Australasia by Mad Men Entertainment. The series has also been localized in other languages such as Chinese, French, and Italian. In March 2008, Peach Pit published a one-shot titled Shoyo no Sukirakata, or How to Make a Girl in the 16th issue of Weekly Young Jump. In the following issue, a serialization for Rosen Maiden was announced. Serialization began in Weekly Young Jump's 20th issue in April 2008 until its conclusion in the issue 8 in January 2014. The second series was published under the Katakana for Rosen Maiden, a sequel to the first series. The series has been localized in other languages such as Italian, French, and Chinese. Peach Pit also published a one-shot in the October 2013 issue of Ribbon, which focuses on the Rosen Maiden's past. Anime Rosen Maiden was adapted into an anime produced by Tokyo Broadcasting System and animated by Nomad. It appeared on Tokyo Broadcasting System and was broadcast between October 7, 2004 and December 23, 2004. It was also broadcast on RKB Manichi Broadcasting. Menichi Broadcasting System, BSI, and Kid Station. Pony Canyon released the series in six DVDs and a box set. Genian USA localized the series for North America and released it on three DVD volumes. In 2008, Funimation gained distribution rights from Genian and released a box collection of the series. Sentai Filmworks licensed the series in 2011 and included it in the Rosen Maiden, the Complete Collection DVD box release. Sentai also made the series available for streaming on networks such as Anime Network and Crunchyroll. MVM Films distributed the series in the United Kingdom. The second series, Rosen Maiden Trow Mend, was first announced in March 2005 and is a continuation of the previous series. It premiered on Tokyo Broadcasting System and was broadcast between October 20th, 2005 and January 26, 2006. It was also broadcast on Menichi Broadcasting System, Chubu Nippon Broadcasting, BSI, and Kid Station. Pony Canyon released the series in six DVDs and a box set. As for the first series, Genion USA localized the series for North America and released the first volume before closing all DVD distribution in September 2007. Following Funimation acquiring the distribution rights, Funimation released the series in three DVD volumes and later released a box set for the series. Funimation later released a box set which included the first series and Trial Mend on May 4, 2010. Sente Filmworks later licensed the series in 2011 and included it in the Rosen Maiden The Complete Collection DVD box release. Sente made the series available for streaming on networks such as Anime Network and Crunchyroll. MVM Films distributed the series in the United Kingdom. The third series is Rosen Maiden Overture, a two-episode series which explores Su Gintao's origins 
It premiered on Tokyo Broadcasting System and was broadcast on December 22nd and 23rd, 2006. The episodes were released on DVD on February 21st, 2007. Sente Filmworks licensed the series in 2011 and included it on the Rosen Maiden The Complete Collection DVD box release and as a standalone DVD. Sente made the series available for streaming on Anime Network. MVM Films distributed the series in the United Kingdom. The fourth series is Rosen Maiden Zarukspulen, referred only as Rosen Maiden in Japan, was announced in November 2012 in Weekly Young Jump. It is an adaptation of the second manga series. Unlike the previous three anime series, it is animated by Studio Dean. It premiered on Tokyo Broadcasting System and was broadcast between July 4, 2013 and September 26, 2013. It was also broadcast on Manichi Broadcasting System, Chubu Nippon Broadcasting, and BS TBS. Crunchyroll licensed the series for Simulcast, followed by Sente Filmworks, who made it available for Simulcast on Anime Network and will be releasing the series on home video for 2014. The complete set for Zarukspulen will be released on October 7, 2014. Unlike previous anime series, the English dub will be done in house at Sente Filmworks. Discography The four anime series resulted in several theme music, radio dramas, soundtracks, and two radio programs. The first radio program is Rosen Maiden Web Radio, Rose Scented Garden Party. An internet radio program that aired on Lantis Web Radio between May 13, 2005 and September 30, 2005. It is hosted by Miyuki Sawashiro and Asami Sanada, the voice of Shinku and Jun, respectively. The second is Sugintao's Night of Inu, a live radio hosted by Sugintao's voice actress Ri Tanaka during Tokyo Broadcasting System's Anime Festa 2006. Due to positive reception, it was continued through additional CD releases. The soundtracks from the Rosen Maiden video games have also been released. Prior to the anime's creation, a radio drama was produced by Frontier Works, who used their own voice cast. Video games. Three video games have been produced for the series Rosen Maiden Dual Walser. Is a PlayStation 2 video game developed by Tato Corporation and released on April 27, 2006. Its soundtrack, Rosen Maiden Belasia Disc, was included with the game's pre order. The game re released under the label Taito Best on March 25, 2007. Taito released a second game for the PlayStation 2 titled Rosen Maiden Gebet Garten on March 22, 2007. Its soundtrack, Rosen Maiden Belage Disc 2 was included with the pre order. The third video game is Rosen Maiden White Zein Z Vi Ab by 5PB for the PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita. It was released on January 30th, 2014. Several manga spin offs were created. An anthology, Takoban, entitled Rosen Maiden and Trakta, was published by Getonsha in 2005. Two anthology series were created based on the second series. The first is Rosen Maiden Doll's Talk by Haro Karuki. It was serialized in ribbon between the January 2012 to April 2014 issues. The second is Mate wa Ikenai Rosen Maiden, The Rosen Maiden That Should Not Have Existed by Chiboro Yompomi. It began serialization in Miracle Jump issue 12. Which was released on December 27, 2012. Two anthology novel series have been written. Chabo Higurashi wrote the anthology novel series The Romana Der Rosen Maiden, which consisted of two novels subtitled Schwarzer Wind and Kalkgrun Augen. Himiro Hisasa wrote the second novel series Rosen Maiden, which consisted of two novels subtitled Zwinja. And Roth Schwartz. The Rosen Maiden has been adapted into three film comic volumes by Gintasha. Two fan books based on the anime were also published. Rosen Maiden Edel Rose covers the anime Rosen Maiden 
and is published by Impress Group. Rosen Maiden Traumen Nocturna covers Rosen Maiden Traumen and is published by Gintosha. Rosen Maiden Comic and Anime Official Guidebook covers Rosen Maiden Zarukspulen and is published by Shueisha. Four art books were also released Rosen Maiden Erinnerung, published by Softbank Creative, Rosen Maiden Kunstwerk by Ichi Jinsha, Peach Pit Art Book, and Rosen Maiden Art Book Rose Maiden, both by Shueisha. Many merchandise has been released based on the Rosen Maiden franchise, such as dolls, clothing and accessories, and other miscellaneous items. Reception Tokyo Pop's localized volumes appeared on ICV2's monthly top 100 selling graphic novels. The Rosen Maiden manga has received generally positive reviews. Anime News Network praised Peach Pit's work as always being able to evoke excitement or laughter from its readers, but was critical about Rosen Maiden's lack of plot and criticized how the dialogue and layout can be vague. Comic Book Bin wrote that while Rosen Maiden was not a splendid manga, its emphasis on psychology and emotion was something American comics should follow to expand their readership. Active Anime praised several aspects of the series, the combination of mystery, comedy, and cuteness with a balance of fantasy and drama. The visual aesthetics of the images and characters, and a broadness that extends towards teens and adults. Initially, Anime Land praised the balance between comedic, daily life, and the underlying dark side of the plot. In later volumes, though, Anime Land criticized the story's pacing and the abrupt ending. In their review of the sequel, Anime Land wrote that they were surprised by the dark tone and how the plot was confusing, even with knowledge from the first series. Manga News also praised the story's alterations between moments of peace and conflict, but panned the later volumes for being rushed and losing the story's complexity. In their review of the sequel, Manga News praised the introduction for being interesting and accessible to new readers. In 2005, Japanese television network TV Asahi conducted a Top 100 online web poll, and the Rosen Maiden anime adaptation placed 50th. In the subsequent year, Rosen Maiden Trauman ranked 7th in a top 20 poll conducted by Japanese anime magazine Animage. Active Anime had several reviewers for the anime series Rosen Maiden and its sequel Rosen Maiden Trauman. Christopher Seaman wrote several praises for the anime, the high quality visuals and the detail in the doll's design, the soundtrack which complements the visuals, and the story which he considered to be engaging, fast-paced, and comedic. Sandra Schulz described the series as a lavish production and that while it is battle-oriented during fight scenes, it also offers emotional moments that cater to girls. Davy C. Jones commented the series is something Chobits fans would enjoy and that Rosen Median Trowman's ending is not a feel-good ending. Rachel Bentham, however, was critical of the plot. Bentham described June's antisocial personality and friendship with the dolls to be disturbing and criticized the quote-unquote there can only be one competition between the dolls calling it misogynistic in nature. Mania initially expressed skepticism of the show's combination of gothic Lolita dolls, magic, and comedy but later calls it a successful experiment and praised the character's interactions and the dolls' designs. In their Rosen Maiden Trauman review, Mania praised the visuals and characters, but criticized the unbalanced comic and dark comments and described the revelations and finale as rushed. Anime News Network's review of Rosen Maiden Trauman was mostly negative and addressed several points the failed attempts at serious drama, which were considered cliche and resulted in cheesy and melodramatic dialogue the recycled background music, and the ending, which was described as inconclusive and slapdash. Anime News Network's reviews of Rosen Maiden Zarukspulen was generally positive. Carl Kimlinger described the characterization of the adult June as a, quote, highly believable mixture of bruised pride, desperate loneliness, and downtrodden numbness. 
and praised how the relatable characters is compared to his younger self. He also praised the scripting for June's life and the scene where June's personality is being dissected by his boss to be intelligently written. Bamboo Dong praised Aruk Shpulin's introduction for revitalizing the series. Both reviewers praised the art and doll's design and expressed concern about the confusing plot. That concludes today's read. Thank you for joining us for another Let's Read. If you've enjoyed today's read of this Wikipedia page, please feel free in the comments section below to make suggestions of your own. Be more than happy to hear. Also, please feel free to like and subscribe. There shall be many more videos to come, readings to be read. Thank you so much for joining me, and have a great day.
Bamboo dong. 